Hi, it's already time for June favorites. Crazy, I'm gonna try to get through this without squinting too much. I really wanted to be outside, but it's very, very humid. So I don't know, I might just start sweating and everything else, but let's get through this. Um, I have several things to show you, quite a few things to show you actually, and they're all just kind of all over the place, mostly household type things. So stick with me and let's talk about all the wonderful things that I found to love in June. need to get a fan out here. Okay, first off, I'm in love with this. Uh, it is the Tea Tree, no, it isn't. It's the Tree Hut Lemon Blueberry Tart Shea Sugar Scrub. This stuff smells like you wanna eat it. I'm not even kidding you. Lemon and blueberry together are heavenly. Here, smell. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. I'm just like, here, smell. Okay, um, it's got these little bits in it. It's just the sugary, you know, the granulation is the sugar. Oh, it's not too rough. It just, you're in the shower and you feel so clean and it's just so fresh and uh, sugary and I don't even know. It you just, I love it. I absolutely love it. And yeah, very happy with this, excited. Now, here's something that I actually got a second pair of because, and I saw that online, they still have them now, but these things go fast. At Target, I absolutely love their little PJ sets. And this one is especially fun I think this summer and I'm always wanting to wear this one but it's in the wash and so I got another one um, but I love this um pattern this print I just think it's so fun for summer so it's the little shorts and the uh top this is the new one I just got ah I can figure out how to make this work let's okay here we go it's the little short sleeve top thing okay buttons down so soft washes wears looks beautiful so so comfy um not tight in the waist whatever whole set it's $21.99 a set love them but this specific print I love I have so many the black one is just classic I love that one I have that I have a navy I have a pink and white stripes I love those I just love them but I wanted you to grab this print if you like it too because it they, they go fast so anyway there's that one my car i absolutely love my car the one thing that i struggle with is where to put my handbag if i have a passenger in the passenger seat if i put it way behind um it's kind of hard to reach and, and it kind of wants to roll around a little bit just a pain in the butt so i found these hooks and it comes in a set of four and i am loving them and my family has taken some for their cars too you can take these hooks and you don't even have to I don't even have to like bring up the, the headrest thing on the back of my car. They just, this opens up and just slides right in that space between, you know, the back of the seat and the headrest. It just slides right in and it clips onto the bar that holds the headrest up, either on the one, the passenger seat next to you or any of the back seats. If it's the passenger seat next to you, you can have it in the front. We just put your handles there or you can flip it around to the back. And that's generally what I do. I have it in the front when no one's there. And then when I have a passenger in the car with me and I need to put my bag somewhere, I just take it and I just flip it around. I don't have to undo it. It just slides right around. And then it's in the back behind that seat, the passenger seat. So I can easily just grab my bag or, you know, whatever I need it. And I know it's not rolling around, etc. And these work great to put behind in the seats behind you. Um, also to like hang uh, shopping bags too. So you know your shopping bags aren't rolling around the trunk or wherever in the back seat. So I'm really loving these. They, like I said, they come in a set of four. They come in several different colors and I really, really am enjoying these. Okay, let's jump to the kitchen real quick. I have quite a few little kitchen deals that I've been loving lately. Uh, this, I have two things to show you for straining. Um, I do want to, like, you know, I'm washing everything all the time, all the veggies, all the, the fruits, all the every single thing we eat or whatever. And then I also don't want to bring out a big colander every time I want to strain my pasta or rice or whatever. Um, so anyway, I have this clip, but I thought I'd give it a try. It's a really neat thing. It clips onto the edge of your pot so that, here I have one, I have this, I, uh, the crusade here to show you. So you just say the so imagine you have something in here that you need to strain. You just clip this onto the side and you pour. 
And I have tried it time and time again to know that it does not then slip off the weight of the pasta hitting it and whatever. It does not slip off. It is very, very grippy. Uh, I've had no problem whatsoever. So anyway, I think this is great. Fits on any kind of pan, super simple. And then you only have this to stick in the dishwasher and, and deal with not a gigantic colander. Speaking of not a gigantic colander, I love this. It's like a short but wide colander. And I can put this over a bowl, you know, just sets on the top. If I want to put something where I, things are going to drain and I want to keep the liquids, I mean, you can do that with any colander, but this size is, I, I don't know, this has worked beautifully for me for so many things lately. And it's just the right size to be able to see what you've got going on. Good size holes. Um, I'm really loving it. It's so small to store. So all those things put together, make it a win-win for me and I'm really enjoying it. And I do find that I'm using it quite a lot. This is a fun thing. My sister got this for me as part of her birthday gift to me and it is the coolest thing and I have been loving it. I make soups all the time. I do try to um, freeze some if I have any left over uh, and it's been working out great but you never know how much to freeze and you wanna kind of fill the, whatever. So she got me this. It is like an ice cube tray. It's called Super Cubes. It's like an ice cube tray for soup or smoothies or broth or stock or anything else. And it's got these little markings for one cup and half a cup. And on the other side, it's 250 mil and 125 mil. So if you go by that and you can just easily pour in whatever it is you're wanting to freeze in that size of an amount. So if you know you want about one cup of soup for lunch, you can just pop it out to the frozen cube of soup heat it in the microwave or whatever, and there's your soup. So simple, so easy. Like I said, it can work for smoothies, um, any kind of a beverage that you might want to uh, freeze, even large ice cubes to like keep a drinks cooler uh, cool. You can do that or floating around in a bowl, you know what I mean, for when you want to keep some things cool there. Um, loving it. What I actually did too is poured some leftover lemonade, some fresh lemonade that I made, and then froze them into the to the squares, and then just kind of scrape off the frozen lemonade like a like an Italian ice. Oh, so good. So anyway, this is fun. It's easy. Like I say, it's silicone. Um, a lot of fun. So I wanted to share that with you too because I had never tried one of these before. But love my sister. She got this for me because she knows me well. <laughs> oh, I saved the tag. This is what the tag thing looks like. Yeah, this is something that I have been using the heck out of. I always carry one of these in my purse. It's the Honest Company Hand Sanitizer Spray. It's a great size to keep with you in the car. Um, you can just have it sitting there in your um, cup holder or whatever. I keep one in my handbag um, or any tote that I'm using that day. It's just kind of perfect. This is the Coastal Surf scent. I just ordered three more of the Grapefruit scent. And it has, um, the ethyl alcohol is 62%. So anything over... If it's ethyl alcohol or ethanol, um, it has to be over 60% to kill everything we need to kill right now. And if it's um, isopropyl alcohol, it needs to be over 70%. So this works because it's ethyl alcohol of 62%. And it smells beautiful. It doesn't sting. It doesn't bother. So if I'm just anywhere and I can just kind of spritz, spritz, I, I spritz both sides of my hands. And just, you know, it's not as goopy. I don't know, I don't like the, the gel hand sanitizer nearly as well, plus it's even harder to find. This just jump right online and order some. It seems to always be available when I want it. Um, so anyway, yeah, no synthetic fragrances or parabens or triclosan or other bad things. So it's from Honest Company and I love it. And it's got the appropriate amount of germ killer in there. Can't beat it. And so I'm ordering more all the time. Love it. I have all my family on it too. They love it too. Okay, this was also a birthday gift that I got and I have been loving it. I've been reading it like a book first, you know, and then I mark the different pages that I want to try recipes from. I love reading um, cookbooks and then finding some new favorites. So I'm going to hope to find some new favorites. I'm going to try them. And when I do, I will uh, make them for you. But it's the volume two of the Magnolia Table really, really loving it. Um, these are the kind of meals that I would actually make. There's coffee cake, chicken Florentine, um, basil chicken pizza, barbecue chicken pizza. Love that. Uh, they've got pictures, easy to follow, Philly cheesesteak. Oh gosh. Overnight black eyed peas, potato salad, you know, just really good type of recipes. Just sort of 
I don't want to say a simple kind of old fashioned kind of down home kind of, but not, you know, a monkey bread, coffee cake, French toast, you know, just with the, with a spin, you know, just neat stuff. So I'm so excited to, to look through this and I've been reading it, like I said, like a, like a book, you know, just for enjoyment on my patio and I can't wait to start trying these recipes. So I recommend this. I've just, I'm looking through going, okay, I love that. I love that. I want that. I want to try this. I want to try that. So it's full of good ones. It's not like those recipe books that it's, you know, weird ingredients you've never heard of and stuff like that. This is, you know, real stuff. So I have been watching my grand puppy, Gracie, uh, a lot lately, which is absolutely fantastic. She and I have a routine in the mornings. Here she'll pop up on the chair with me and we just sit there and listen to the morning and start our day off listening to the birds and squirrels. We call squirrels tree dogs. Is that a tree dog? <laughs> anyway, it's wonderful, I love it. And then later on in the afternoon, we take a big walkie and she gets very thirsty. It's very humid and hot here right now and I am loving this. Every time we go to the park, every time I take her anywhere, I can screws. <laughs> we just fill this up with water, it just unscrews. Fill it up, screw it back up. And here's the best part, okay? This opens and closes it, so it's closed right now, so you can't push, you know, no water will come out. When you open this up and you push this button, the water just pours right in there, okay? So you pour in however much you want. Puppy takes a sip, and then when you are done, you don't have to dump the water, you just pull, push the button and pull, you know, just kind of pour it back through that little hole right there. And it goes back into this for a puppy to have some later. So, I don't know, it's, I just think it's the absolute best thing. It's got this little lanyard deal to carry it with you. Loving this. Have you guys ever tried Turkish towels? <laughs> have you ever been in a Turkish prison? <laughs> Sorry, a line from airplane. Um, yeah, Turkish towels. It's something that I've kind of wanted to try for the longest time. I'm thinking, well, people say great things, blah, blah, blah. Thought I'd finally try one because I really liked this color combination more than anything and it was on sale and they still are. Um, but a Turkish towel is a lighter version of what we would use as like our bath towels. It's not the loopy stuff. It's just as absorbent, if not more, to be honest. It's a little bit bigger. It's almost like, it's almost like the size of a beach towel in a way. Um, it's got the little fringes on the edge but it just soaks up the water and then it just dries so much more quickly than your average, you know, regular loopy bath towel. You can use this for picnics. You can use this um, to sit on in the sun if you're like sitting down at a park or something and you wanna sit on something easily. You can use this as a scarf. I mean, it's adorable. Um, you know, you're just kind of getting a little chilly or whatever. You could use it as a scarf. It can be used for so many things. Just wash it, hang it to dry. I ha it does say hang to, or yes, hang to dry. And I have done that, but I've also thrown it in the dryer and it's just fine. But I love it. Love it, love it, love it. And this is something that I'm going to give away for my giveaway this month. You will get your very own in this exact same pattern. Give it a try. It's perfect for summer. Throw this in the car. It, it basically, let me show you here. And this is how they describe it too. It folds up easily to throw in any any suitcase, any um, travel bag. They say it folds up the size of a burrito and it does, okay? It's easily, I'm not doing this very well because I'm doing it quickly, but you can easily fit this. It's a big burrito, okay? But it's, you know, it easily fits in any bag, any suitcase, and can be used for so many things. To sit down on a bench that you may not think is clean, to, like I say, use as a scarf, or a shoulder or head covering, or to sit down in the park if you want to just sort of sit down for a while under a tree to read or something or have your lunch, um, as a beach towel, as a bath towel, so many things. So yeah, I think it's great. I love it. And one of you will be receiving this um, if you win the giveaway. So as usual, all the giveaway information will be down below the video. Um, just click where it says, click here to enter the giveaway and all the information will be right there for you. So anyway, try, if you'd like to try to win this Turkish towel and there are so many other colors and styles and things, I have linked everything down below. If you click where the towel is, you'll see all the different color combinations and so forth and they are on sale. So anyway, take a look 
and enter the giveaway if you'd like to have a chance to win that one. The drawing will be a week from today and the person will be notified via email. So that's how that works. So I hope summer has been treating you well. Um, it is going very quickly, but I'm enjoying every second of it. My flowers are blooming like crazy. My tomatoes are going well. Um, my herbs over there are fantastic. It's just really hot and humid right now. So that makes everything grow like crazy. Um, but yeah, that's what summer's all about for me. So love it. I plan another trip to my parents soon. So that'll be great. And it's all good. Everything's good. Have a great day. Thanks. Bye.